Hi guys, and welcome to my manga pickups for the month of May. Uh, let's just get started straight into it and show off Ultra Jump April issue, which is of course the magazine that Jojo Leanne runs in, as well as other stuff like the Steins Gate. I'll probably won't be able to find it. There's a Steins Gate manga in here. Um, and this issue in particular came with, you can get it, a mini Jojo Vela. Uh, Jojo Vela is the latest Jojo art book. Um, so this one came with some select pieces from that are shown in said art book. Uh, my favourite being, if I can find it, without actually having to turn it around. Apparently I can't. <laughs> ah, yeah. Jolene and Stone Free. Uh, it also came with a mini stands book, which also comes with uh, Jojo Bella. Uh, this one showing off some of the latest stands from Jojo Lian. Uh, Paper Moon King and Nut King Cool. And their yeah, stand users. Yeah. Uh, next up, Ultra Jump May issue. Nothing really to be said. Jojo's Bizarre Adventure Stardust Crusaders on the back, because the anime is running and it is awesome. And this issue came with a Jojo bag, which is the same on both sides, pretty much, and the sides. It's not particularly big, pretty much can fit a basic manga Pokemon inside. Hmm. Next up is more Jojos. Since Stardust Crusaders, pretty much all of it is now back in print. I was able to get it with me only now missing volumes 6 and 8, which are back in print, but expensive on Amazon still. So if you're in America, get it off Right Stuff or Barnes & Noble, because it is a normal price there. But... I can't because shipping is horrendous. Uh, it's like $40 to send one book. So there really is no point in doing that until it appears on Amazon or Book Depository for me. So 16th and final volume. So now just missing 6 and 8 as I said, but I do have the Japanese Bunko box. So. I'm not holding out for it. Next up are just some odd pickups. Uh, Berserk Volume 1, which I have put in a plastic seal case. Uh, Attack on Titan Volume 12, which is the latest volume. Hunter Hunter 32, which is again the latest volume of this. Um, and it is the final volume before the new chapters, which has just started and the new chapter will be in Shonen Jump this week. Uh, so that is awesome because I can't wait because it's going to be the new arc and the anime is going into the election arc in July. So it will be awesome. Uh, next up, Dead Man Wonderland Volume 2, which I think Volume 3 might have just released. So yeah, Dead Man Wonderland is awesome. So check that out too. And my final pickups for this month are some Suzuhiro Yasuda stuff. So... Dudarada SH, uh, Volume 1 of many, probably, because it is the new arc. Uh, so those are the new characters. I don't know their names off by heart. Sorry for the glare. Can I block it out? Not really. Sorry. But I will show the insert with them. That's them. Eh, sorry. And then Alba and Mikado's head. I'm putting this away. Next up, more Suzuhiro Yasuda stuff, but previously out of print volumes of Yozakura Quartet, which came into print for a few weeks, and my friend in Japan got them for me, which is awesome. Thank you, Shiori, if you are watching this. 10 and 13. Uh, she also found in a magazine an alternate cover for volume 15, which I've just wrapped around. Volume 15. Uh, 
said friend also sent me some white day cards that she got. So Kagero Days and other series which I do not know the name of. And then some adverts for the Yozo Koro Quartet. This one is advertising the Durarara Yuzu Quartet crossover. And then advertising the release of Hanano Uta. And then this one, a final one. And some Attack on Titan vans might enjoy this. That is apparently Eren on the left. I don't think it looks like him, but whatever. Uh, that is it for my May pickups. See you next time. Janet. Just quickly, if it focuses, it probably won't. Time skip Mikado. Okay, again. Janet.